Hi, I'm Peggy Tucker and I'm a master sugar artist and I'm here to show you how easy it is to color the cake play isomelt sticks. Um, you simply heat it in the microwave, you're clear, take any gel color and it really takes color extremely well so it doesn't require a lot. One little drop, set it aside and as it incorporates you'll see it bubbling and fizzing and that's what we want it to do that's actually the moisture in the gel um, burning off and so if you give it just a little swirl it won't incorporate the color all the way and then you can do a cute little pour and you'll actually have it in multi-colors then I'm going to set it back down and I'm going to fully incorporate that color for you And that's all there is to it. And you are now ready to do your pour. This one I'm going to finish off by just popping the top down onto it. And we'll make this cute little flower for you. And you're all going to want to know where this little mold come from because it's adorable. Watch now. But can you see the beautiful color we made? One little drop. So if you add two drops, of course, the darker the color is going to get for you that's very pretty and I can actually just pour it out here for you and you can get a better better feel of that color look at how gorgeous that pink is there we go let's see if our little flower is done and I'm going to set it down there so you can see the variations in the color that are still inside that so here's another way that you can actually um, change the color of the, your isomelt sticks. This is just the regular orange, which is absolutely gorgeous this way. And it's been heated in the microwave. And I'm just going to pour a little disc for you to be able to see it. And then I'm going to let it cool, then add the white piece that I have, and then show you by mixing it the beautiful color. Now when adding that white piece back into the microwave, it just takes a few seconds, so be very careful not to burn it. Bring it out and begin to swirl it. And you can see how it incorporates. And now my orange has become an opaque. And I'm just gonna continue to mix it so that I don't have any white streaks in it. However, if you wanna have it marbled, it's a gorgeous, gorgeous look. And so here's my pour next to the solid orange. And you can see that it's also thicker. The white is a little thicker and it gives it that beautiful look. Now, when those dry, I'll hold them up for you and you'll be able to see them. All right, so now that they've cooled, I can pick them up for you and show you the difference in them. This was the Cake Plays Isomelt Orange. This is the orange when they've added a little bit of their new white to it. Gives it that beautiful opaque look. If you take and do that and use them in molds, here's the orange again. Here's the yellow, which happens to be one of my favorite colors. And then the red. Can we just see the difference in those? It is absolutely gorgeous. So there you have it. The only limit to coloring and tinting the Cake Plays isomelt sticks is the limit to your imagination.